Are you alive? Yeah. All right. Hello. Can everybody hear me okay? Um, just give us another couple of seconds, guys. We're just starting to get everything organized, but just let us know if you can hear us. How are we doing, guys? Merry Christmas, everyone. Okay, and we're good on we're good on YouTube. Yeah. All right. Welcome to St. Thomas. Okay. For everyone over on the Instagram, please head over to the YouTube to uh, check us out and uh, see the different angles. But uh, we are anchored currently in Charlotte Amalie, St. Thomas, and we're about to uh, pick up anchor and uh, make our way into the dock at Yacht Haven Grand in, in St. Thomas here. So give us another couple of minutes. The guys are just finishing off lines, and then we'll be able to fire up, pick up the engines, and we'll get out of here. So let's get the engines warmed up though while we're waiting. So um, hey, engineers, engineers, you guys can fire up main engines, please. Okay, yeah, copy, thank you. There we go. Change out marks for you. I'm gonna change marks? This one's got the, the mute. Ah, oh, perfect, thank you. Okay, have you changed me on the controller? Okay, can you? Yeah, go, Dev. Sorry, just doing a radio check there. We uh, didn't, didn't hear your call to the engineers. Yeah, copy. Okay, alrighty. We're just in the middle of firing up main engines. Another couple of minutes and we'll get out of here. I've just got to do some quick pre-departure checks. Port main engines just firing up now. So there she is. She's at RPM. So I cut another 30 seconds or so. You'll see starboard uh, main engine come online. Cool. Excellent. Everyone that's over on the Instagram, please make sure to head over to YouTube. We've got a few different angles rather than just the one that's stuck in here looking at me in the bridge. So then there we go. There goes starboard main engine. Cool. Can you get me on that one, please? <coughs> I've got Blair with me right now up in the bridge, but uh, Bjorn will be joining us in a little while as well, the second officer. So, and then, cool. What we'll do is we'll move this one over a little bit like that. Perfect. All right, that beeping noise means the engineer is ready for me to take command in the bridge. So I'll do that, and that gives us command. So that now means that my stations are active. Okay. Bridge, engine room, uh, you've got control of the engine. Uh, copy, I've got command. Thank you very much. Uh, port ahead. So just going to go through the controls, make sure that everything's good. Beyond, beyond, can I have you to the bridge, please? Okay, that's port ahead. Port is down. So what I'm doing is I'm watching here. It shows me shaft rotation. So the shaft rotation lets me know that what the controllers are doing is what the engines are doing. So there we go. Starboard ahead. Starboard astern. Okay, starboard rudder, so up here, my rudder angles, just watching that, so that's full starboard rudder. Center, and we're gonna go all the way to port. And there we go, port rudder. Okay guys, I'm good in the bridge. Can we uh, get ready to start hauling anchor, please? You have my wing station, starting with starboard, please. So there we go. So, yep, you can haul. Okay, so I got I got Corey up forward. So what I'll do is I'll bring my camera over, and we can watch him. So, short stay two o'clock. Copy. So with this camera, I can see Corey and uh, watch him hauling the anchor, making sure that everything's good there. So. Twelve o'clock long, copy. Coming ahead a bit. So 
So he, he tells me where the anchor is at all times. So 12 o'clock long means that the anchor chain is leading 12 o'clock straight ahead. And then long stay means that it's at tension. So that means I need to bring the boat forwards. The uh, capstans aren't strong enough to pull the boat. And then it also grinds the chain against the boat. So we just bump it ahead a little bit, take that load off. You want the chain nice and loose and then just being hauled up by the anchor. Okay. How are we doing back there, Valen? There you go. Perfect. Cool, so there we go. Now I can see I can see what you guys see. This is my first time being able to do that. It's fun. 12 o'clock medium, copy. So still 12 o'clock, always want to hear that 12 o'clock or just slightly off to the side. We have a starboard anchor out. So anywhere between 12 and two is kind of where we want to have the anchor. And then medium means that it's, you know, medium tension. So low would be straight up and down. And then long is, you know, tight in front. So medium's not bad. How are you doing with your drone? Short stay, one on deck. Okay, so short stay, straight up and down, one on deck. So he doesn't really give me a direction at that point because it is straight up and down. One on deck means that we have 27.5 meters to go. We have, are in six meters of water below the boat. So, you know, we've got another 20 meters or so to pull before it's off the bottom. Excellent. Up and down, up and down, copy that. Okay, so for those of you on the Instagram, head on over to the YouTube and you can also see what uh, a couple of different camera angles. Right now, currently we're looking straight ahead so you can see what the boat sees also from the mast cam. So uh, shoot on, head on over to the YouTube and you can see that. Also, Blair's gonna put the drone up shortly and give us drone shots. So uh, you'll be able to see the boat as we're entering the harbor. Hey, Blair. Dude, Are you mic'd up? No, no we haven't, haven't got a mic on Blair yet. He's running around like crazy, but we're... Uh, anchor, off the anchor off the bottom, copy that. There we go. So, anchor off the bottom. He's just got to pull it up now into the pocket. Not too much longer. I'll then give us a big reverse out of here and then spin us around out to uh, port and make our way in. So, oh, look at that. <laughs> Anchor clean and clear, bring her home, thank you. Okay, so anchor's at the waterline. Corey saying clean and clear means he's got nothing fouled on it. It's not covered in mud or any other debris from the bottom. So that just means he's gonna bring it up home and uh, put it back in its pocket. Okay. Anchor in the pocket, wash off, copy. So hearing that, the wash basically we have we run our wash pump when uh, when holding the anchor, and that, what that does is big four big water jets that spray the chain and the anchor as it comes home, knocking off all the mud and sand and other debris from there, so that we don't bring it on board and fill up our chain locker where the anchor sits when um, nothing's on board. So uh, yeah, okay, coming astern. Okay, Davy, coming astern. Uh, I'm going to come back. Just keep an eye on that port channel marker for me, please. Yeah, copy that. I'm going to come back maybe one whole boat length and then start to spin. Copy. Copy that. Thanks, Corey. Anchor secure. Okay. Just put up my reverse cam so I can see behind us. Um, there's a, there is a, a channel marker, just a red channel marker, just off of our starboard side. So I just want to make sure I don't hit that as I come back and start my turn as my uh, starboard bum is going to go in towards it as I start this turn in a second. But I think we're looking pretty good. Okay. All right, we got Bjorn with us. Say, say good day, Bjorn. Hello, hello. 
Bjorn's second officer on board. Normally he's got some styling sunnies on. Yeah. <laughs> Can't find them. Can't find them. Okay, no. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so Bjorn, Bjorn being the second officer on board, he's, uh, he's going to stay up here with me for the maneuver in case I need a hand, second set of eyes, radio communications, and just uh, na navigational aids. So uh, he's up here with me. I've also got Blair on the bridge. And then Chief Officer Davies down on the aft deck, and he runs the back of the boat as we uh, approach the dock and start docking. Uh, okay, starting my spin. Uh, bum to starboard. Can you do the AIS, please? Yeah, okay. Uh, ferry coming outbound? No, blue hold uh, ferry coming inbound off your starboard side. Yeah, copy. I see him. Thank you. Okay, so we just got a little island ferry coming in around the corner here, but he's moving quite quick, so he'll be fast. So I'm just going to keep my spin. He'll stay out of our way. Okay, so my rudder's hard to port. I'm starboard engine ahead, port engine astern. And what you'll see now is the whole boat starting to twist and spin around easy. I haven't got bow thrust here online yet. I'm gonna bring that on in a minute. I'll just check and see what my engine is. So we do, we've got one, two, three generators on board. On Loon, we do have a big electrical bow thruster. So we bring all three generators online to handle the load of when I'm thrusting, but also we keep them all on so that if one generator fails, we still have the two as backup. So, uh, just as a redundancy in, in maneuvers. Okay, so that's the ferry coming in behind us now. But uh, looking good. Let's get this maneuver over. I didn't test the bow thruster in PDCs, so I should give it a little wiggle now just to make sure everything's good. So bring the bow thruster over, you listen, and you, there it goes. And then also if I come over to the things, I can see the load on the generator, on the generators come up here on the conning station, which means that my bow thruster is going good. So there we go, come back. We don't need it for this maneuver. Conning. Okay. Comes the swell from that ferry. Yeah, big slap on the butt back there. But so far so good. Just making a nice easy maneuver here. Just bringing her around. For everyone over on the Instagram, guys, please head over to the YouTube. We've got different camera angles and a lot more going on over on the YouTube there. Mark, why do you call the stern the bum? Well, it's the back of the boat, isn't it? You know. <laughs> Paul, Paul, you've got another spot ferry inbound. Uh, he's just coming between the port and starboard markers now. Yeah, copy that. He should go down our port side. We're good. I'll hug the starboard. So another ferry, another ferry coming in. It's about that time of day. What is it? 4:30 local here. So a lot of the ferries returning from the BVIs and where they've been. So we'll just hug the side of the channel here and let them all come in much faster than us down our port side. <clears throat> All right. There she goes. OK, cool. All right, let's, we've got some time for some questions while we're here. Any progress on the online store? There is. I'm sorry. We apo I apologize. The online store is happening, guys. We just, uh, it's not as easy as you'd think, um, putting an online store together. But uh, Blair's been working on the uh, Shopify store. We've finally got a uh, manufacturer, a really cool manufacturer, to make us uh, a recycled plastic, environmentally friendly uh, clothing. We're also changing the entire crew's uniform to that. So that's something that we're super excited about. And the uh, online store should hopefully be up and together by, um, by early January. Where's the drone shot? Good question. Where's the drone shot, Blair? It's coming. <laughs> Blair's behind me freaking out everywhere, but it's fine. What cruise ship is that? Uh, 
It is the Norwegian Escape. So there actually is three cruise ships down here on our starboard side. So as, you, as we come in, you'll, you'll see them all. Um, that one there is the Norwegian Escape. She came in a little after us this morning at about uh, 9 a.m. Um, once we round the bow of the cruise ship, can you radio the Yacht Haven Grand and let them know we're coming? Thanks. Is Tyler on rotation? Yes, Tyler actually just rotated out at the uh, beginning of December. And so Davey, our other chief officer, came on board. So Chief Officer Davey is with us now. Take off. The home point has been yeah, updated. Be able to see Please in check a second, it on the map. You can see Ambition coming out now. She's uh, come out of the uh, marina. Ambition, what is she? She's a fed ship, I think, isn't it? Like a, yeah. look, looks very fed shippy. You can see she's got a little, her chase boat on tow as well. Okay, let her get through. She's going to come around and then take us down. So we'll go port to port. Nice. Authorization zone re edged. Authorization zone re edged. Did he just do a security call? Authorization zone re edged. Uh, too funny. Yeah. Okay. Just coming in. There's a bit of boat traffic at the moment, guys. Sorry, I'll, I will keep chatting, but uh, just making sure we got a little sailboat coming down our starboard side. Authorization on our port zone side, re edged. Just making sure that we come around the cruise ship here nice and clearly. But uh, yeah. Authorization zone yeah, we're in, uh, St. Thomas now in the U.S. Virgin Islands. Uh, we've come in and out of here a couple of times already this year. It's uh, one of the main hubs that we use for the BVIs as the clients can get in with their private jets and get to us. So it's much easier for customs and immigration and all that sort of stuff. For much better produce for us to go. We try to buy local as much as possible, but down here in the islands, most of it is imported. So we make sure that we you know, get the best of the best for our clients. Okay. Sorry? Silver Lightning's going to be leaving the dock now. Okay. Channel. What channel are you on? Tech. Okay. Yeah, cool. Okay. Looking good. Have you spoken to them yet? Yeah, I can do it. Yacht Haven Grand, Yacht Haven Grand, Moody Yacht Loon, Loon. Hey, good afternoon. Uh, we're just coming around the bow of this uh, Norwegian cruise Fly ship right cautiously. now. Okay, copy, Lynn. Uh, we'll be ready to receive you shortly, Anna. Okay, Phil, are you good for me to just keep coming in? Lynn, uh, just stay in touch on 10. I am on 10. Yeah, copy that. Standing by 10. Oh, the drone's up. Look at that. That is a cracking view okay, there, boy. Look at that. Oh, we've got Sheffy up here as well. Sheffy, you want to come say hi? Just uh, making sure everything runs smoothly. Yeah, guys. you want to you wanna take over? <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> what's, what's happening, Dino? Uh, just uh, drop guests and doing a bit of crew dinner. Oh, nice. What we got for dinners? Uh, what have we got? Oh, there we go. <laughs> uh, yeah, basically, leftovers from the, uh, the guests. Actually, we got some lobster, some turkey from Christmas. Do I have to put it there? Not so close. You're uh, getting sorry, guys. <laughs> sorry. Yeah. Uh, little Behind us, there's a, uh, there's a 50 meter that's going to come and dock in. Busy time in the evening right now. So, um, yeah. I think we're still frozen, though. Blair. 
YouTube is down, YouTube is down. Everyone on the Instagram, thank you guys. You know, I think maybe we're getting a bit of uh, shadowing from our satellite with the, with the cruise ship. So, uh, do I need, can you refresh mine? Um, so yeah, I think it was just a bit of shadowing from our satellite as we went past that big Norwegian cruise ship right then. But uh, we should be back up and running now. Perfect, look at that. Where's you, what, what view is that? Where are we, Blair? That's going down port side, isn't it? Yeah, so that's a port side aft view that you're seeing on the YouTube right there now, guys. Loon, this is Vivin, Vivin. Vivin Loon, uh, let's go 1-7. Loon, this is Vivin. Good day, guys. Yeah, is that you in the power cap? Yeah, copy that. Starboard, starboard. Uh, have a good day. Thank you very much. You too. It's very hard not to say little power cap then. <laughs> so, there we go. Okay, so it's just a, uh, a small power cap on our bow right now. Vivin, they just gave us a call. Yeah, let's go with Fenders once I uh, do the spin here, guys. Yeah, same thing with the spin. Okay. Okay, so that's Chief Officer Davey just asking when he can put the fenders over the side and also he opens up the side door so that as we're approaching the dock I can see where to line the gangway up. But um, yeah. Cool. What do we have a forward facing view right now? Nice. So Hon, I'm gonna go back up. I know that uh, that we got a question from David Dillon before. Have you thought about collabing with Yachts uh, for Charter and David Seals? Um, actually, I, I've been chatting with Dave, but uh, he is, uh, he's a broker with Northrop & Johnson, which is another brokerage house. We are with IYC. So, I mean, I'd love to do something with him in, in the future. I'm not sure how that's going to work with two different uh, brokerage houses, but uh, maybe, maybe down the line we'll, we'll figure out how to, how to do that and keep everybody happy. So, cool, look at that drone shot, wow. What, what's the name of this cruise ship? Does anyone, anyone see it? Crystal Serenity, very nice. All right, I'm going to start my turn now. Okay, Davey, starting my spin, spinning to port. Okay, so I'm hard over port rudder, port rudder astern, uh, port engine astern, sorry, starboard engine ahead, and we're just going to do a complete 180 now, so Blair will show us with the drone as we, uh, as we come around. So. Okay, and there she goes, she's starting to, starting to turn now for me. It's not like driving a car, everything's quite slow and relaxed when, when driving these large super yachts. So it, it just happens nice and slow. So you just take her patiently. Okay, that's, they'll, they'll man the fenders as we approach the dock to make sure that they're in the right location. Excellent. But uh, you might need to refresh your YouTube if people are saying YouTube are down on the Insta. It's, uh, it is back up. Could we do something with Nick from Aquaholics? Oh, yes, definitely. We have been in contact with Nick from Aquaholics. It's more just trying to line up our schedules. He's, uh, we, were, we were at Monaco, Fort Lauderdale, and uh, Antigua Boat Show, and he wasn't at any of them. So um, I think they're more Mediterranean-based. Whereas we're over on the Caribbean side right now. All right, the spin, there we go, about 90 degrees, another 90 to go, so, but we're, we're looking good. Lee, thank you for the comment. Paul, I found this channel a month ago and you guys are my favorite. Uh, and Chef Nina too. Oh, sorry, Dean. Sorry, no, I've still got Chef Dean up here with me. You got to give Dean some love, also. 
All right. I'm just going to start coming a bit more astern here. How much vacation time do you have for? How much vacation time do I have? I have a lot of vacation time. How much do I use? Not much. <laughs> uh, when you love your job as much as us, uh, you, know, you know, every day is a vacation. So, um, for guys on YouTube, if you haven't actually watched our la latest YouTube yet, go check that out. It was a, uh, a crew day off in the BVIs recently where we uh, went and hung out in Necker Island and uh, fed the lemurs and got a bunch of kite surfing in. We went for a scuba dive, went to Willie T's. So, um, you yeah, know, we had a great time out there. Excellent. Okay, starting to come astern. Rode some turtles. Rode some turtles. <laughs> Tortoises, actually. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'm going to move out to my wing station now. So, Bjorn, do you mind just transferring me in a sec? Take, you take command out there. Okay. And then you're going to chase me with the cameras, right, Blair? That's it. Okay, perfect. Okay, so you ready, Bjorn? Yeah. She's yours. Okay, so Bjorn's out on the wing station. He's going to take command. Got it? Yeah. Okay, perfect. Moving outside. Okay, Davey, moving to starboard wing. Okay, there we go. Okay, so I have command out here. So we're just going to keep coming back. Looking good. Oh, there you go. I got a great view. So, uh, so right behind us here, you can see we've got Dreamboat on, on the dock. And we're going to go past her, and then we're going to go all the way to the end. So we've got tons of room. Nice, easy docking today. Um, this actually would have been a good one for Davey, but he decided to choose the back of the boat. <clears throat> um, can you bring my YouTube iPad out, please, Blair? Okay, we're just coming straight down now, Davey. Perfect, thank you. Cool. It's a little harder for me to read questions now, guys. I kind of need to concentrate a bit. Maybe Blair will read some out to us. I see he's still flying the drone. And then... Uh, what license do you have? Hey? What license do you have? What license do I have? I'm a Master 3000. So I can drive vessels up to 3000 tons. But there we go. Straight rudder. Stone in both. So straight back down now. Nice and nice and quick, straight down the channel. Stone in line with the bow of dream boat. Stone in line with the bow of dream boat. Copy that, thank you. <clears throat> okay. Awesome. Coming back down. We're just going to glide her now, so I'm in neutral. Just let the momentum of the boat just glide backwards. It should be enough to get us pretty much all the way into the slip. So nice and easy. <clears throat> uh, the dock master said we have enough room to take Gaston all the way to the dinghy dock, Davey, but I'd rather not go back that far if we don't have to. Okay. So, we like to think we're the biggest ship on the ocean, but sometimes.
Okay. All right. Well, the YouTube is down. Sorry, guys. We're uh, we're having a little bit of issues. I think maybe with all these big cruise ships here, they're sucking all the bandwidth out. But uh, it looks like the Insta's still up and running. So you can kind of see me. We, the YouTube's up as well. Nice. Yeah. Hey, welcome back, YouTube. Sorry about that, guys. Um, we actually have just up. We're just got some material to upgrade our uh, some new hardware to upgrade our live stream. So hopefully next week when we go uh, do our next one, we'll uh, be much better. I think maybe just having three cruise ships in port and all these other super yachts here with everyone running Starlink now is just unfortunately not putting the amount of bandwidth out. Um, have you still got a drone up? No, it's not. No, there's, okay, there's another one flying around us. So we got another drone doing some circles around us right now, but uh, for the YouTube guys, sorry, it looked like you missed most of the docking there, but we're uh, tied up now in, in the harbor. The guys are just doing the final touches and uh, getting the lines in, but we are tied up in alongside in, uh, in here. So, um, yeah, you got, a, got another camera angle we can do there, Blair? Yeah. So, yeah. Sorry about that one, guys. Hopefully the next, uh, hopefully the next live stream will, will work better. We've bought a new... Uh, a new module that blends all the uh, blends all the systems. So we have three Starlink antennas, but previously we weren't able to join them all together to give you one super pipeline. And then also we can bring in 4G, 5G, and also Wi-Fi. So between them all, we should be able to have seamless, high definition uh, live streams. But this one, this one didn't quite go as great as we hoped. But it should hopefully in the future work work beautifully.